Hiya, um, I wanted to show today how to put a, a reduction French bed, uh, like the Louis Ratten beds or the Rococo beds. There's also some beds called carved Louis Ratten beds. Um, they they will also be delivered in four parts: headboard, footboard. We've got side rails, then the slats with the center rail. The first step with this bed is to match the correct corner uh, to the side rail and one of the sides is actually numbered with an A and that will be the same on the side rail, A. The number one is the number of the slats, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That side most likely will be the left side, the, the, the side that's numbered. And um, if we fit this one first, it will just make sure that the rest of the work will be correct as well. Yeah. There is a metal hook at the end of each side rail that corresponds with the side rail and the headboard will be the same for the footboard with the other side. And all we need to do is to hook that um, part inside there. and have it down to line up the bolt at the inside. And once it's lined, we'll screw it in. Not not too tight, just as tight as um, we can just secure it in place so it doesn't come off for the moment until we've built the rest of the bed. We'll do the same as well for the footboard. So the next step is that we'll do the same for the footboard. We'll line up the metal bracket side rail with the footboard and slide it in. We will do the same for this side as well. For any reason, if the bolt doesn't align 100%, what you really need to do is to push harder on that side rail to get it as down as possible so that the bolt would go through. However, this one does align properly, so we'll park in this corner as well. There's something to put through the bolt hole to get the bolt all the way in. Once the corners had been secured, the next step would be to put the centre rails in. But we have to watch for the codes again. So this this one centre rail is called A2 and it matches the same corner A2. After that, the, the slats would be the last step to put on the bed. And these beds are normally got about 90 slats and they're all different shapes. But you'll notice there is a number for each slat as well. And as long as each slat go in the correct slot, so that's number one, which slot here, number two. Three will have a certain shape which will match with the side rail. Now the bed is complete once all the slats are on and is ready for the mattress. Thanks for watching.